Hi, I'm Bob. Today, let's talk about panel data and how to use stata commands to handle a variety of research questions that arise when you have panel data. First, we will learn basic data management tools and summary statistics for panel data. The stata command reshape converts data from wide form to long form and vice versa. We declare the data to be a panel using the command xtset. The command xtsum computes the means, standard deviations and other important features of panels. First, please download the dataset from my Google Drive using the website address under this video. Save the dataset panel-wide DTA in your current working directory and then open it by click on the open button. The dataset contains labor force information of women from 2005 to 2015. Now the data is in what is called a wide form. All information, all variables of each individual is in one observation. The stata command with shape long can convert the data from wide form to long form. With shape long is followed by all the variables names. After comma, we use the option I to specify individual and the option J to specify year. The result we obtain using restraint long is a panel data set that can be used in Stata. For each individual, there are observations for each observation year. We use the command xt set followed by the individual variable and the observation year variable to tell Stata we are using a panel data set. Let's look at the first 25 observations for some variables. For the first individual with ID number 1, we have her information for 5 observation years from 2005 to 2013, while for the second individual with ID number 12, we have our information for 6 observation years from 2005 to 2015. So the panel data is unbalanced. Some respondents drop out of the survey during the observation period. This is called sample attrition. Another aspect of this example is called sample selection because we are only using women who are in the labor force. Next, we use xtsum to take a look at the variables mean, standard deviation, minimum and maximum number. The between variables of wages are calculated by averaging each individual's wages over time. It gives us the between individual variation, while the within individual variables represents the within individual variation. The between individual variation for wages is larger than the within variation. Thank you for watching the video.